What's up? In this video, I'm going to show you on how to use the date picker in JavaFX. The date picker in JavaFX is similar to combo box or the color picker because the date picker is a combo box style control. So when we are going to click the date picker, it will pop up the calendar. So the date picker allows the user to enter a date or select a date from a calendar. All right, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you on how to use the date picker in JavaFX, and we will display the selected date in the label. So let's get started. Open your scene builder because we are going to use the FXML base application. So right here, I have labels and a date picker. All right, so when, when we are going to click the date picker and select a date, so we will display the date here at the selected date label. So let's go here at the date picker and let's see what's in the properties section. So we have a prompt text like this, like that. It will update here. So we can have enter your date, enter, enter date, something like that and the date picker is also editable we can check or uncheck this one all right so let's go here at the fx id so we can select the we can set the fx id of the date picker i have to change this to uh, date picker and also on action event all right all right so let's go here, the selected date, and let's set the FX ID to selected, selected date as well. So we will use this one if we are going to select a date here. And let's see if the controller is, has been assigned. All right, so let's save, and let's go here, the IDE, and let's inject some FXML codes right here. At fxml and let's import the private date picker oops all right and another one for label uh, selected nope the private is in capital P. All right, and let's import the label. Okay, and as well as the on action event. Date picker. All right. So if we're going to run this application, it will not work obviously because we haven't set anything here. All right, we can select the date. Okay. So if I'm going to select the date, it will display the date here. So we'll see. So we'll see how we can do this. So I'm going to call the uh, selected date label that set text and date picker that get value and to string let me run the application All right and let's run this application to see what that look like so if I'm going to select the date, let's see August 9, it will display the date here like this pattern. So if I'm going to <coughs> write a pattern that will display August 29, 2022. So we need to use the local, local date is equals local date is equals to date picker that get value and 
we need to use the string date pattern is equals local date that format date time formatter that of pattern we can also use this one string pattern is equals m date and year or direct this one here all right and let's try to call the selected date label selected date that set text and date pattern so let's try to run this application to see what that look like all right if i'm going to select a date here it will display august 11 2022 and we can also edit the date picker to one april may February 2024 that's it I hope you learned something new in this tutorial please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share and I will see you in the next video